Hello class, I am back for our religion lesson today. Um, I have pages 67 and 68 from the God Made the World workbook. It'll be posted for you to print if you don't have this at home. Um, we are going to begin discussing how God made all living things. So today we are going to talk about one thing um, specifically, which is flowers. Um, we're going to talk about how God the Father made all the flowers in the world. I want you to look at these flowers. These are God's gift to us. I want you to look at all the beautiful flowers in the picture. What flower do you like best? I really like the pink ones. What flower do you like best? Do you have flowers in your yard? If you do, what color are they? Do you know what kind they are? So there are so many different types of flowers out there. They all have different names. You might know some of them. Um, I know a few names of different flowers. We have roses, right? Tulips, carnations, um, daffodils, lilies. You might know some other ones, maybe some of mom's favorite flowers. Um, Flowers smell really good too. If you put flowers in a room, soon the whole room smells nice and fresh, right? Flowers make the world more beautiful and God is good to give us flowers to look at and smell. I also want you to think about what flowers need to grow. What do flowers need outside to grow? They need a nice, nice rich soil, right? The dirt. They need dirt to grow in. They need sunlight. They need water. Water is very important. Water, sun, and soil are the main things flowers need to grow. You might um, help mom or dad in the spring and summer plant some flowers. Um, I want you to then turn your paper over and you're going to circle the flower that is different in each row. So you're going to look at the three fl flowers and then you're going to find the one that's different and circle it. So I don't wanna give any away, but that's what you're going to do for this activity. I'm gonna read you a little something as well. While on earth, God's son Jesus taught us about God the Father's love. Jesus wants to know that God the Father gives flowers their beauty and strength and that he has given us even more and will always care for us. He also sends the rain and sun that help the flowers grow. So God made all of our flowers. You guys might have some flowers at home right now sitting on your tables. So that is our religion lesson today. Can't wait to see these. Um, you're going to look, remember, look closely at those pictures to find the one that's different. I also want to tell you that May is the month of Mary. We talked about Mary a lot during the year. You all should know who Mary is. Um, but next week, we're going to start doing a lot of talking about Mary because May is the month of Mary. So I hope you enjoyed that and I will see you all in a little bit for our afternoon center activity. Bye, guys.